Hello crazy coders, today I will create a guess game with python using the file handling concept. I have made two, two text files, one for questions and one for corresponding answers. So I want to create a python program which will read the questions from this file, ask them the user and compare the answer given by user with the correct answer and display the score in the end. So let's create a new python file. I will name it quiz game2.py and it is recommended to use with block when working with file. So let's do that. And now in the with block I want to open two files and to open a file it's simple. You just provide open and two parameters one the name of the file which is questions.txt and the mode in which I want to open. So I want to open in read mode, that's why I will provide R. And I want to open it as Q's file, so questions file. And I want to open one more file which is uh, answers.txt and I will want to open in the read mode. And I want to open it as ANS file. So let's do that and see here I have, you should be providing the entire location of the file but since it is in the same uh, directory uh, even the name works. So yeah let's continue. Now uh, I want to create two lists. One that uh, stores, reads all the questions from the file uh, and uh, converts them into a list. So for that, the com I will just uh, write down the code and I will explain it what it does. So I will use a list comprehension with a strip function. So what this basically does is quiz file dot read lines read all the contents of the file and uh, f the for loop uh, does one thing that is read one line at a time and uh, what it does is it stores that uh, one line in the question and by stripping it what strip basically does is uh, it removes the unnecessary the spaces, tabs and new lines of the string and this gets stored in questions. So let me create one more for answers. Similarly I will use answer dot strip for answer in answer answer file dot ans file dot read lines similarly so as you can already see this reads the lines and what for each loop uh, one line is uh, taken into this variable and it will be get stripped and stored to this list so now after converting this into the list. A procedure is same as of similar video. I will create a variable named score and then I will create a for loop with two variables one for question, one for answer and uh, I will use the function as an iterator which uh, will take two arguments that is questions and answers so these are two iteratables, it will take the two files, sorry two iteratables and convert them into a iterator object which is tuple uh, which will be the pair of uh, each question and answer and we will be accessing it through question and answer variable. Now I want to ask the user for the answer, so I will create a variable user answer and ask for the input with the question as a prompt. Uh, with a question tag 
I provide a space and now I have, just, I have to just check for the is it uh, equal to the right answer or not so I will just provide an equality if statement in the if state I have to just answer now if it's correct print correct and increase increment the score by one so we can do by this else we can print in correct so to make sure there is no logical error I will just lowercase the input as well as the answer so that the computer only checks for the answer not for the cases so after this I want to just print the score uh, for that I will use f string because it's easier to format in f string final score will be a six score uh, or total score the total score total number of questions uh, we can access by and uh, knowing how many questions are there in the questions list uh, which can be accessed through length function so I will pass questions list so we are done with this let's pretty print this uh, in the center of the terminal I will provide 100 what this basically does is it uh, prints this line at the start of 100 character from the left so now let's run the score so as you can see the first question is appeared I'm gonna answer it so it's incorrect uh, I don't know the answer so for a second I'll arithmetic logic unit it's correct and uh, who invented WWE I don't know so I don't know so yeah I got one question correct and my final score is printed in the center and it's 1 by 3 so we were successful in creating a quiz game using the file handling concept and uh, the advantage of uh, using the width bl block is that it automatically closes the file we opened in the in width statement so that's it from this video thank you for watching and we will catch you up in the next video